Here we are in Leamington, Ontario, and we're going to look at the company New Energy Farms. They have developed a technology to take vegetative tissue from plants that don't really have seeds, think of sugarcane, and make it into a seed. So their technology is called seeds. And what's really great here, and what is the true success, they just signed a commercial world license with Syngenta, one of the largest pharmaceutical companies in the world and agricultural companies in the world, all from a small farm here in Leamington, Ontario. So behind me is a crop of uh, commercial sugarcane variety. What's been interesting for us is we've got a long history in crops like the Miscanthus, and the Miscanthus is a member of what's called the sugarcane complex. So it's one of the original parents of, um, of sugarcane. So for us it's been very interesting that a crop we've got a long history with and experience in is actually directly related to the new opportunity in sugarcane. We identified that the opportunity in the sugarcane market was very, very large. And for a company like ourselves to develop that market would be quite challenging. So we identified at an early stage that we needed to find a partner. And we had um, discussions with Syngenta over about 12 months. And for us, they have the leading platform, we believe, for developing and supplying sugarcane in Brazil. And so we've been very, very pleased to, to have a partnership with Syngenta to, uh, to go forward and, and, and develop and commercialize the seeds product in Brazil. The, the, the actual current systems of propagating a lot of these field crops are based on using quite large and bulky um, material that's grown in the field, vegetative cuttings. These can be rhizomes or, or large sections of stems. And actually this works, but there's a number of difficulties in actually scaling up. And so what the alternatives are, are currently to propagate high quality material in the greenhouse. And so this is the other option, to produce very, very high quality propagules in the greenhouse. The actual benefits of the seed system is we look to combine the actual low cost aspect of field production, a price, but also to produce something in the greenhouse that delivered the high quality propagule that the growers actually wanted. The actual product inside is the actual, the actual pre-grown vegetative tissue with growing media, nutrients and other stimulants to aid fast growth once planted. And the whole product is coated with a, a wax and fiber uh, mix to, uh, to actually protect it during storage and also to buffer uh, moisture conditions during planting to allow it to be planted in conditions that would be suboptimal for other planting products. So these here are the actual rhizomes from the Miscanthus crop behind me if we grew this crop in the field for propagation. This system works and we still do it, but the seed system allows us more rapid propagation to get new varieties to market much faster and also, more importantly, to be able to drill the crop like a row crop. So these here are another product we've actually supplied in the past, which are some plug plants for propagating these crops. These are provide a very, very good establishment, but the cost of producing them and transporting as well is, uh, is much higher than, uh, than the market would support for large-scale planting. And in addition, it's very, very hard to plant these products in more challenging environments, which is why we created the seed product that can be directly drilled and, and survive when conditions are more challenging. Well, we've actually reached a stage now with some of the agreements we've now got in place that um, it really is an actual turning point for the company to be able to be working on such diverse and large scale crops um, in, in very different uh, markets and geographies of the world. So for sure, this has been a turning point for, for new energy farms.